that this baseball diamond is the orbit of the moon. Now, the diamond's square and the orbit's round, but you get the idea. Now we need a sun. Ah. So let's say that the Earth is on the pitcher's mound. Now see, by the way, the scale of this globe and this moon are about right with respect to the orbit of the moon. That's the baseball diamond. Now notice that right now, when you're standing on the Earth, you can't see the moon at all. This is what we call a new moon. And the reason you can't see it is the moon is between you and the sun. Now, the moon orbits the Earth in this direction. So when the moon gets to first base, it's a half moon, because sunlight is falling on half of it. Huh? Then it keeps running to second. Now, when the moon's back here at second, it's a full moon. That's because the moon is on this side of the Earth. And here's a trick. The moon's orbit isn't flat. It's tilted. So a lot of times, when the moon's back here, we'll be way up here. But notice it's still a full moon. And this is why most of the time, the Earth's shadow doesn't fall on the moon. It's almost always full. Got to keep moving. On to third. So over here at third, it's a half moon again. But look, the shadow's on the other side. That's because we're on the other side of the Earth. Well, time to break for home. So with the orbit set up like this, the moon would end up right on home plate. The moon scores a home run every month. No idea. No idea. The way I don't I have no idea, dude. I don't know. Well, no. A shadow of the earth. Gravity. Gravity. Um where it is in relation to Earth. Um is it the orbit around the Earth? The rotation of Earth. I think it's sun? No. I, the rotation of the moon and how the sun relates to it. The rotation of the Earth? The sun and the rotation of the Earth and all that fun stuff. Uh, I don't know, the uh, astrology, Gemini constellation. I have no idea. Earth's rotation around them? The positioning of the Earth in relation to the moon, I guess. The sun? Shadow on the moon? The earth blocking the moon. Er, the earth blocking the sun's rays to the moon. Tides. The placement of the earth between the sun and the moon. How the solar system works, like how we rotate. I mean, isn't it just because of the position of the, the shadow on it? And the shadow of the earth? From the sun? <laughs> Cloud cover? No, it's the sun. Is that to do with the sun? It's something to do with the sun. Tides. The tides? Mercury. It, it's not the gravitational pull from the sun, right? Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna say final answer. I don't because know. Because the the way no, I like the dumb. earth and the moon are rotating around each other, so the earth blocks in some way at different parts. It's its position in the um, Earth's orbit, right? Or it has something to do with it, the shadow of the Earth and the sun positioning and, and such, right? I forgot. Totally forgot. Well, it's caused by, like, the rotation of the Earth. Is it, like, the tides in the ocean? <laughs> it's my time to shine. It's my time to shine. The day is over now, so it's my time to shine. It's the moon, here to regale you with the two. I'm so bright up in the sky at night, but the truth is I'm just reflecting light. See, let me help you break it down. The earth and I are spinning around, and I orbit the earth in a loop. You see, the moon is kind of like my hula hoop. We both
don't orbit the sun, he's the big shot. I'm the center of the solar system, I'm so hot. The sun's like a light bulb, and I'm like a mirror. Light bounces off me, and then it appears to the earth below for a lovely view. For animals like wolves who go, oh, woo! Sometimes I'm full, sometimes half on. Sometimes I'm crescent, or it looks like I'm gone. But I'm here in the dark, just a lonely moon. Hoping that somebody will visit me soon. I'm covered in dust, and I'm made of rock. So come see me soon, and go on a moonwalk. Phases. The moon looks different, but it never really changes. It depends on the position of the Earth, Moon, and Sun.